everybody. I'm trying to get my camera fixed just right. So give me a minute. I don't know how that bugs me. It looks a little crooked, but anyway. Okay. Welcome to Tuesday. And uh, it's late in the evening. It's 4.57 p.m., so it's almost 5 o'clock. And warning, this is probably going to be a long video. Because I am just in a talking mood right now. I want to talk to y'all. There's quite a few things I want to talk to y'all about and tell you about or whatever. And y'all know how forever it takes me and how I go into detail. And it just ends up being a very long video. So I'm just going to go ahead and tell y'all this is going to be a long video. So, like I said, this is Tuesday morning. Albert and Benny is at work. Elizabeth had today off, but she slept in late because she was up late last night reading. Then she got up and got around and went to town, and she ain't come back home from town yet, but she'll be back in in a little bit, probably. Um, I also slept late because I was also up late last night. Uh, doing several of my stuff in here in my room and then reading my book and uh, so I slept late later than I have slept in a while <sighs> talking after lunch late <laughs> I don't like it when I do that really for me but oh well when you're up late you have to have your sleep you know so anyway the first thing I've done is while I was eating breakfast and taking my medicine, I checked my email and watched some videos. Then I got on my treadmill back here and walked. And I walked for, on the speed of 15 for 10 minutes. That's what I kind of been doing. I think that's kind of the, the speed I need to do and how long I can do right now. Hopefully later I can pick up and go longer than 10 minutes with it. Um, then I read my Bible and uh, then I've not had my lunch yet because I just getting up late you know and having the late breakfast I'm not hungry and ready for my lunch yet <laughs> so um, I've been watching checking more email and watching more videos so I, I went in the kitchen and I've done some straightening up and cleaning up in there and I've got my clothes on washing. I got a basket of clothes on my bed I need to fold up and put up. Um, so that's what I've been doing so far. So now I am making my vlog and then I'm going to start uploading it. If I can. But, being it's 5 o'clock now, late, and it takes me so long, it's going to take me a while to make this video and then to put it up because if it's a long video, it's going to take a long time to put it up. Uh, today being Tuesday, you know, I've kind of reserved Tuesday to do my, where I get on my old journal and read to y'all on camera. and. I, I want to put another one of them up, so I got to make another one of them after this one. If it's not too late, I may have to pass and wait till next Tuesday. I don't know. I'll just have to see. But that's what I'm going to try to do. Um, and then I'm going to start working on all my stuff again that I've been working on. And it's taking time. It's a lot. It's going slow. <clears throat> so, but I am slowly getting there, and I am slowly feeling like I'm getting things accomplished, so I like that. Okay, I did want to mention, I think it was yesterday, if I can remember right, that I made the video where I welcomed my new 
subscriber, the little girl, seven years old. Uh, her channel name is Lorena Robertson. Um, I wanted to mention, because she's made a few more videos now, and, uh, she's, and I've watched them, so y'all need to go check her out. She's a cute little girl getting her own channel started. She done a cooking channel. She done some, uh, what you call it, spaghetti squash. And then she done another little, uh, video where she just kind of told a little bit about herself and then asked us to ask her questions. So, y'all go over to her channel and watch that one and ask her some questions so that she can answer y'all. Um, but I found out in my video yesterday, if that's when it was I done it, when I welcomed her, which the name of her channel is Lorena Robertson, but I had said it like it was her name, like Lorena was her name, but it ain't. Her name is Jordan, and that's what I wanted to point out. Uh, the lady that helps her record the videos and talks on the videos, you don't see the lady, but she talks. I'm assuming that's her mom. Uh, Jordan, if you watch this, let me know in the comments below if I'm right or wrong. And if that's her mom, it may be that her mom's name is Lorena. I'm not sure. So I just wanted to, you know, let y'all know that I had said it like Lorena was the little girl's name, but it's not. Her name is Jordan. Okay. So, uh, um, I want to ask y'all, I've got what I've done, what, if y'all are wondering what I'm doing, I've got a notebook here. And I have actually, there was so much that I wanted to talk to y'all about and explain and ask that I have actually jotted it down so I would remember because there's a lot of times, you know, I think about all this stuff I want to tell y'all. Then when I actually make the video, I tell some of it or most of it, but there's always something that I forget and I didn't want to forget. And it's possible because it was earlier when I thought of this and then I finally decided I'm going to write it down so I don't forget. So when I wrote it down, it's po possible I didn't think of something to write down that I had thought of earlier. See what I mean how I go into detail about something to make this a long video? <laughs> so anyway, um, so I still may have forgot something, but that's what I'm doing. I'm looking at my notes and deciding which one I want to I ain't really talking about them in the way I've got them wrote down. I'm deciding because some of it involves me picking up my tripod and moving it to show y'all something. And I want to do all of that last. I want to just sit here and talk to y'all about all the other stuff. So, here we go. I want to ask y'all a question. Do any of y'all out there collect postcards? The postcards, like you know, from the town or the state that has the name of it on there and that's, you know, advertising something about that town or that state or whatever. Or any kind of postcard. Do y'all collect postcards? So the next question is, if you do collect postcards, what do you do with them? Do you just keep them for yourself to look at at times? Do you craft with them? And if you craft with them and use them as in crafts, like say as junk journals or whatever, exactly how do you craft with them? And how do you store them and organize them? And that's my question. And I think my daughter just drove up and I'm hearing the car door slam. So she's probably fixing to walk in the door here in a minute. The dogs will kind of hurt her and run into the door. So y'all let me know in the comments uh, under this video about the postcard situation. Okay, the next thing I want to tell y'all about is how many of you knows Shannon Green? <laughs> 
subscribed to Shannon Green's, and I hope I'm saying her name right, I think it's Shannon. Shannon Green's videos. She's a crafter. I love watching her videos. She's fun. She kills me with her laugh. How she laughs and what she laughs about. The, the jokes that she makes out of some of her Happy meal that she gets, you know, little things, and it'll be something, and she'll start laughing about it, and then she'll tell us what it's making her think of and why she's laughing. It's, I love it. Um, she does a lot of she does a lot of painting, and she does pretty paintings. She does junk journals. She draws all kinds of different little journals, and I love the way she does it, and I love to watch her do it. And she is always getting happy mail. People, her subscribers is always sending her happy mail, sending her all of this odd junk mail, which she loves and uses in her journals and crafting and stuff. <clears throat> Things that I wouldn't think of to use, you know, I would think that's trash thrown away, but once I watch her, I think, hey, that's a neat idea. I want to do that, you know. So, she is always getting all of this Happy Mail. And she does videos showing herself opening the Happy Mail and looking at it. And she's got all this neat stuff that she gets. And I love seeing it. And she even there starts as she's opening it and looking at it. She sees things that she thinks goes good together. And she puts it together and she says, see there, that right there, that is wanting to go together. And be something or be a little journal or go in a little journal. And when she's pointing it out, I see it too. And I love that. And it makes me want to do that. <laughs> so, um... She has recently put up a couple of organizing videos about her craft room. She's been organizing her craft room. And she put one up <laughs> where she has one wall. I kid you not. It seems like anyway, or looks like the, the whole wall. Probably not. It just seems that way. That the whole wall is nothing but them little plastic drawers. You know, the little tall things that normally are on wheels. I think she took her wheels off and just has them sitting and then she has one stacked up on top of it. So she has them stacked. Kind of like my cart over here except for I don't have all drawers. The top of it is slanted shelves. Um, but hers is all drawers. And she's got her stuff in it and she was showing those drawers and she showed how she had her crafts and stuff stored in those drawers and everything. And it just made me see and realize and want drawers and want to organize all of my stuff in drawers like that. So now somehow in some way I'm going to have to get some money and go find me some drawers and buy them. <laughs> so anyway... <laughs> I'm just thinking of something else she said that was funny that she laughed about. At the end of that video, she said something to the nature like, so now y'all know what's in my drawers. And then she started laughing, you know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> if, you know, I'm sure y'all get that. If I can get it, y'all get that. I mean, back in the day, that's what people called our underclothes drawers, you know. <laughs> so anyway, I just love watching Shannon. She's a, she's a hoot. <laughs> but she's making me want drawers. Shame on her. So now I'm going to have to go get me some drawers. But also, she has done another video showing how she organizes and stores all of the things that she works with and uses and crafts with in her journals and stuff like the junk mail and like the junk mail stuff that people send her in happy mail and the way she's got it all organized it is so neat and each thing has its own spot you don't have to there's nothing mixed that you have to look through and dig and find 
or that you forget that you have, like I do. I'm not happy with the way my stuff's organized. I don't know what all I got. I can't get to it all, you know, to see what I want to use. And so I like how she has hers done, and so now I'm wanting to reorganize my stuff again. <laughs> and it's Sharon's fault. <laughs> And she's got some neat ideals. But I've already got so much that I'm working on, that I have been behind on, that I'm slowly working on, that I am slowly getting accomplished and caught up on and feel happy and excited about that I'm getting accomplished with it. I want to keep going with this, but I want it to hurry up and get done, you know, because then I want to get the doors and I want to do the organizing like she does. And just... <sighs> taking forever <laughs> so anyway um I wanted to tell y'all all about that Becky my sister the Becca JB if you were watching this I have some questions for you I know you love drawers and you have some and store your drawers in I actually sent her the video from Shannon about the drawers because she, Becky loves, well, I'm sorry, Becca. Becca loves <coughs> the drawers, too. But I don't think she has as many as Shannon has. I sent her a video, and I, and I left a comment, and I said, I think she loves drawers more than you do. <laughs> so, anyway, my question is, Becca, how many drawers do you have? And... The next question is, you know how they have some of the drawers are like really, really, really deep? And then some of the drawers are, I guess, what you would call shallow, about like this. Is all of your drawers the deep ones? Is all of them the shallow ones? Or do you have some deep, some shallow? Which ones do you like the best? What ones do you have the most of, the deep or the shallow? I'm thinking that the deep ones won't work for me because there you go again. There it would be. I would pile everything in and, that, and fill that drawer up. Then to find something, I would have to dig through it and I wouldn't be able to see everything and know what all I got. And I would forget what I got. I'm thinking the shallow drawers would do better for me. You know, to just put a few little things in where I can see and know what I've got. Um, there's probably a few big things and big items and stuff that I might could use some of the deep drawers for. But every time I have went to the stores to look for these drawers, and it's been a while back in the past, because trust me, I've not been shopping in a while, I don't have the money to shop, total no, another whole video that I kind of want to do, but not sure I should, but anyway, when I've seen these drawers, I have only kind of seemed to have seen the deep ones, I think she's talking to the dogs in there, I hope she's not calling me, anyway, I can't hardly seem to find the shallow ones and I want to get mostly like I said there might be a few things I could use some deep ones for but I want to get mostly the shallow ones I think those would do me better so Becca and anybody else out there that gets these drawers or that has them and has gotten them and is using them you know what do you like better the shallow or the deep how many of deep and how many of shallow do you have where is the best, cheapest, let me stress that word, cheapest place to get these doors? Because I have no money, people. It has to be cheap. And to even stress it more, what y'all call cheap is too high for me. So I need it even cheaper. And that's sad, but that's my life. Okay. Like I said, a whole nother video. Alright. But yes, I want to know a good place to buy these things at. And where can I find the shallow ones? Okay? That's my question on that. 
Alright, the next two things to talk to y'all about, and we are almost at 20 minutes, which means it's going to go over from this video videos together, and it's going to be really long, and it's going to take a very long time to upload it on YouTube. Oh well. So, the next two things I wanted to talk to y'all about and tell y'all about involves me picking up and showing y'all. So, <laughs> here we go. I have to get you turned around. I have to turn my screen around. Okay. I have been going through another box. Remember my boxes stacked up by the wall in the utility room that I'm slowly going through. I think this is my third box. And the other two was quite small and mostly what was in them was books. That bottom shelf down there with books stacked on it right above those bags. Um, so this box so far looks like it seems to be all like loose papers and folders you know and things like that that I'm having to slowly go through. I have done throw it a lot away and this is a small stack right here of, that's come out of it that I'm wanting to keep. So I just wanted to let y'all know this is my duster because everything is dusty and I'm trying to dust and clean as I go along you know. So I wanted to let y'all know that's one of the things I'm working on. Oh, sorry, I bumped the camera. Didn't mean to. So I am slowly working on my boxes. This one, I started this one yesterday. It was late last night. I was doing a lot yesterday. Like I said, I was up late last night. So by the time I actually got to the box and started on it, as you can see, I didn't get very far. I was really getting tired and ready to just quit with everything and read my book and go to bed. So that's why it's barely started but I'm gonna try to work on it some more tonight and um, the next thing is my pocket letters I've been working on the state pocket letters that I owe I got Courtney's done I didn't mention that I think and it's sealed up so now I have started it's all stacked over here I'm not going to show anything in detail but I have started on Charlotte's, my oldest sister's, state pocket letter that I owe her. After hers, I have to do Amanda's and Colleen's. Then I owe Courtney, Aunt Bill, and Angela, and maybe somebody else, a regular pocket letter that I've got to work on. Uh, I can't remember. I'll have to look. It's like over there on my behind me the big where I get my finger right the big brown tall desk is where all of the pocket letter stuff is but I've been bringing it over here and sitting down and working because I, I generally try to watch videos as I'm working and doing things too because I have so many that I like to watch this is the Fooly Living that they live in Israel and so that's a camel right there they're driving in their car and they're passing that camel on the side of the desert road. And, um, so anyway, but I'm working on it. You know, I wanted to let Charlotte and all the others know that I am slowly working on it. And slowly getting there. I just wished it could go faster and speed up a little bit more. But, oh uh, well. So... I have now talked about everything that is on my list, unless I forgot to write something down that I thought about earlier. If so, I'll think about it after a while and then it'll get aggravated with myself because I couldn't remember it. <laughs> so, alright guys, that's all I have for you for right now. Like I said, I'm not sure I'll get the journal reading video up today. I may have to wait till next Tuesday. And I soon want to hurry up and do the next Bible study video, too. I may try to, to do that later tonight myself. And get it up. Alright, guys. So, um, that's all for now. So, y'all take care. Answer my questions. Leave them in the comment box below this video. 
And I guess I will say until next time, I'm done, I'm gone, toodaloo.